My name is Kanisha. My name is Arman and I am in grade 6 and I am 10 years old. 11 not 10. Yeah, 11. No, he forgot his birthday. <laughs> My brother Deepak, I love him very much. Don't touch his hat ever. This is my sister. Nobody knows who she is. Guess her name. Asif is my younger brother, and I think we're quite similar in many ways. But um, Asif is the more gregarious, fun-loving. Noshad is uh, the middle of three brothers. He received the tallest genes in the family, and I'm very jealous. My sister Zoe, lovely girl, so funny, so cool. That's my sister Ariana. One of my role models, I would oh. say. I wouldn't tell her that. Oh. <laughs> She's crying. Okay, yeah. gosh, yeah. guys. Okay. Ye hai meri behen, Sana Sayyid. Ye hai meri notorious, Choti behen, Samreen Sayyid. Naitik Soda. Vishakha Soda. Radhika. Pooja. Neha Dvivedi. Diksha Dvivedi. Mustafa. Suzefa. My name is Arsha, I'm 19 years old. My name is Arshan, I'm 19 years old. And as you know, we are twins by now. She's my sister. And he's my brother. Being an Indian, hardcore Indian, everybody knows what Raksha Bandhan is. I have to give her a gift. She has to tie me a Rakhi and I'm not supposed to let anybody trouble her. But you only trouble me. How I remember discovering Raksha Bandhan is actually my mom telling me. But she found a very interesting way. She put on a movie, I'm not sure if it was an Amitabh Bachchan movie or something, but an old Bollywood movie and we began to appreciate what that relationship is all about. And then she told me I'd make a lot of money. My mother actually used to tie a Rakhi to my father uh, because they used to say that it's the first Rakhi was tied by Shivji's wife to him to like take care of her. We're Muslim. <laughs> And so we didn't really ever get exposed to this until I moved to India. It's the one day you know, like definitely you're gonna meet. My dad's sisters used to come home. So as a kid, I'm like, what is happening? So I'm like, now give me a brother. So after 12 years, my parents are like, okay, here's your Rakhi gift. Now you can tie Rakhi to him. Lost a lot of money during this festival. Uh, <laughs> we don't celebrate Raksha Bandhan. <laughs> In school, I remember we had to make Rakhis for yeah. our brother. And when we went home, like we could tie it on him and all of that. It didn't happen. We were born on 25th August, 99. And on 26th August, 99 was Raksha Bandhan. And then we've been celebrating it since then. So essentially for us, Raksha Bandhan was thread that was tied for protection. I don't think the sisters today yes. need any protection I because agree. they're good enough. We need protection from them sometimes. <laughs> it doesn't matter whether it's a brother protecting a brother, maybe somebody he went to college with, maybe two girls that are best buddies and, hey, I've got your back. Uh, since the last two years, uh, we've been also tying Rakhis to each other. She being the closest person in my family, so why not her? You know, it's not like the girl can't protect the boy. The change is so much needed now. You don't have to be a man to protect someone. Typically, when we think about protection, the first instinct is always to think of external forces. I think Noshad, has been very helpful to me in terms of protecting me from my internal uh, issues. People are gonna get past this concept of having to just like physically protect your sister. I think that people are also realizing that guys should be able to share their emotions and I think yeah. it's important that their sisters support them. I would want him to be available to me emotionally. I really don't expect my brother to beat up some guy if someone says something to me. Guys like us don't land up in college the day Raksha Bandhan is there for obvious reasons. What do you think about this concept where brothers can tie Rakhis to brothers and brothers can tie the Rakhis to their sisters? It's a great concept. Great, great idea, man. I love that. You know what? I'm going to do something different this Raksha Bandhan. I'm going to tie Malani a Rakhi. I want it to happen. Please. Okay. I would actually say that'd be a good thing because like he said, we have a, it's a very loving relationship but it's not a very outwardly displayed don't touch me. We've done enough talking, but there's a little surprise. Oh, what is this? Yay! I get to tie you a Rakhi this year. Bhai behen ko mega Rakhi. So cool! I'll promise him that I will never hate him. I promise to keep reminding you to be a bit selfish all the time in life. Noshad, I promise that whenever you decide to grow your hair longer, I will be there to support you, to braid it. Thanks bro, thanks. I need money. I promise to love you and still always take your clothes. 
especially the black brandy yeah. tap. Yeah. I promise to be by your side no matter what happens, man. And the money that I have to give you is squared because you have to give me money. No, so no, 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 no. I promise to correct you when you're wrong. That's the worst. Thank you, thank you, sir. Happy Raksha Bandhan. Oh, I love it. Mwah! Can I eat myself? Love you. It's the first time we're doing it and we had so much fun. Thanks for introducing us to this. You can celebrate Rakhi this way. It's like both of us like get equal opportunities. It's nothing like boys have more power so only they can protect girls. Girls are also safe. Remember that it's not just about brothers protecting sisters, sisters protect their brothers too. And it's about spreading that love and putting some positivity out in the universe. We are nothing against the brothers. I think brothers also rock really. <laughs> We are wonderful people, I swear. And don't forget, you may end up getting better gifts than you probably have ever given her. Have a great Raksha Bandhan. <laughs>